The M577 APC is a heavily armored transport vehicle used by the Colonial Marines. This armored personnel carrier is of lighter weight than its previous model and is capable of transporting equipment and soldiers into combat zones. It is fully armored and equipped with weapons. This model runs on a 4x4 wheel layout and at the core it has a 286 kilowatt multi-fuel gas turbine engine. Its armor is made from bonded titanium and includes a 5 cm foam packed floor to protect against fragmentation mines. The inside of the hull is filled with boron carbide ceramic tiles that are coated with polymer resin. This prevents cracks or shattering as the vehicle travels across terrain. Because of this model being designed to be more lightweight, its armor is not capable of stopping explosives from tanks, but it is still viable to use in situations that revolve around standard firearms. There is room inside this vehicle for 13 passengers, along with a station for a section commander and a driver. This vehicle has sufficient space for ammunition and other supplies, but it is not recommended for a full crew to remain inside as the space is limited and it can get crowded. Now in situations where this vehicle is used to resupply an outpost or other infantry, no more than two days worth of supplies will be transported at a time. Now the midsection of the APC is dedicated for the section commander to watch over the mission's progress through the Tactical Operations Center. This section gives a direct feed of audio, video, and vital signs from the crew. The driver is stationed at the front of the APC but has limited view due to its small window size. This design was to limit the amount of vulnerabilities on the APC. Now this vehicle also comes equipped with a sensor cluster mounted on the main searchlight. It also has a thermal imager, TV optics with magnification, a UV detector, and an ultrasonic motion tracker. These sensors can reach about 3000 meters in open terrain. It also has a flare decoy device and a wave tracking jammer. Now the weapons on the front of the APC can either be a Gatling gun or even a laser gun, while the large cannon on the top is mostly a mortar weapon. Now the mortar cannon on the top can also be adjusted to the back of the APC to lower its overall height. Now in the movie Aliens, the APC is seen driving over a xenomorph and acid sprays near the back of the vehicle, although it was not explained how much damage the APC would have suffered from the alien's acidic blood, so this topic is still up for debate. Now the novelization of Aliens shows the APC having six wheels instead of four. Also in the movie Alien vs. Predator Requiem, the APC used by the National Guard is supposed to be an homage to the APC from Aliens. And also in the movie in 2002 called Equilibrium, they did feature a vehicle that resembled the APC from Aliens. So what did you think of the APC vehicle? Would you like to see it again in a movie? Put your thoughts in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video, then subscribe to see more content around the Alien and Predator universe. Thanks for watching. My name is Asaglow, and I'll see you in the next video.